بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ربی یسر ملا تو اسر و تمہ بل ہے رب ضد نیلما السلام علیکم ہوپ یو لور گڈ دس از دی میتھمیٹکس دی تھری اپڈیٹڈ سیونتھ ایڈیشن اینڈ ٹو ڈے وی ول ڈو ایکسرسائز تھرٹین اے کوشچن نمبر ون اینڈ ٹو لیٹ اسٹارٹ اسٹوڈنٹس ناؤ اسٹوڈنٹس ایکسرسائز تھرٹین اے دی نمبر آف دی لیپ ٹاپ سولڈ ایچ ڈے اوور اے پیریڈ آف نائنٹین ڈیز فار ریکارڈیڈ دیز آر دی نمبر آف دی لیپ ٹاپس اینڈ دس از دی فریکوینسی when the data is provided in a group just like that 0 to 5 5 to 10 and 10 to 15 we have to make the histogram or frequency polygon uh, if the data is provided in the group now we can see the in part number one we have to draw the histogram to illustrate the data we have to draw the histo diagram uh, histogram and in part number two using the same diagram draw a frequency polygon to illustrate the data Now, so this is a graph paper. I take the number of the laptop along x-axis. This is x-axis, and the frequency along the y-axis. And the group is from zero to five, five to ten, ten to fifteen. The group which are provided in the question, I write like that. And now we have to draw the uh, histogram. Histogram is uh, from zero to five. The frequency is nine. From zero to five, and this is nine. and we have to make the histogram like that this one from 5 to 10 this is 5 this is the point 5 and uh, from 15 to 22 and uh, from uh, 20 to 25 this is one the frequency is one and we have to draw it like that this is one Now, so it's, this is the histogram. This is the histogram uh, in between number of laptops and frequency. This is the histogram. We have to draw the histogram like that. And this is the group data which is provided to us and we have to make it. In part number two, we have to draw the frequency polygon. Frequency polygon is uh, uh, drawn on the midpoints. Now, we have to find the midpoints. Now I am making the column of the midpoint in the book. There, you have to make it on your notebook where you have to solve that question. Number of the laptops, midpoints, and then frequency, and then draw this point of uh, on that uh, diagram, on that histogram. Now I am making the column of midpoint there. Zero to five midpoint. How we find the midpoint? We have to add both the values and divide it by two, and we get the midpoint. Zero plus five divided by two, we get two point five. This is two point five, and five plus ten, and divided by two, we get seven point five. This is seven point five, and uh, next is twelve point five, and next is seventeen point five, and next is twenty two point five. These are the midpoints. Now we have to draw the frequency polygon uh, according to these midpoints.
now the midpoint we have to first uh, mark the midpoints from 0 to 5 this is 2.5 and this is the first point this is the first point of frequency polygon and the second one is 7.5 this is in between 5 and 10 7.5 and next is 12.5 which is in between 10 and 15 next is 17.5 this one and the next is 22.5 these are the frequency polygons at the points now we have to join these points and we also join the point from zero like that and then this is all and now students this is a frequency polygon this is the frequency polygon which i made on the diagram of the histogram and that is the demand of the question we have to make it like that and now students the question number one is solved now students question number two the following table show the distribution of mark of some student who took part in science quiz and this is the table now in part number a we have to copy and complete the table we have to complete that table these are the marks and these are the tally of these marks it means uh, 56 to 60 marks got these students these these are the number of the students who got the marks from 56 uh, to 60 and these are the marks and these are the tally now we have to write the lower class boundaries lower class boundaries is 0.5 we have to subtract the 0.5 from this value 56 and the upper class boundary we have to add the 0.5 in this value now students see our lower class boundary is 55.5 and upper class boundary is 60.5 this is 60.5 and 60.5 65.5 and 75 70.5 and 75.5 and 70.55 and 80.5 and next one is 80.5 85.5 and this is 85.5 to 90.5 90.5 and 95.5 95.5 and 100.5 in lower class boundaries we have to subtract uh, 0 0.5 and in upper class boundary we have to add 0 0.5 and we make that like that now we write the frequency and the frequency of uh, this marks is 7 this is the 7 and 5 6 7 this is also 7 and 5 and 10 5 5 2 3 and 3 and these are the frequencies and we have to come we have complete that table and in part number a we have to do it copy and complete the table in part number two to which class do the marks 90.9 and 66.2 and 81.5 belongs now we have to illustrate from which class these points belong 90.9 90.9 9 come in this class you can observe that the uh, 90.9 now you can understand why we do this why we make lower class boundaries and upper class boundaries by doing this we get the exact class 90.9 is uh, come in this class this is 91 to 95 this class became from 90.5 
and from 99.5 and 90.9 is come in between it now 66.2 66.2 come in the class belongs to the class uh, 66 point in this class 66 to 70 and the next one is 81.5 81.5 is belong to this class 81 to 85 now students the part number three use draw the histogram to represent this distribution we have to make the histogram and in part number four using the same diagram draw a frequency polygon to illustrate the data we have to make the frequency polygon first we have to draw the histogram now so i make the class interval with the lower class boundaries and the upper class boundaries we have to make it like that from 51.5 to 60.5 and this these are these value which I take along the x-axis and now we have to make the uh, frequency a uh, histogram and the frequency of this is uh, from 55.5 to 60.5 is 7 and we have to make the histogram And the next one is also 7 and, and the next one is 5 and the next one is 10. from 75.5 to 80.5 the frequency is 5 and the next is also frequency is 5 And from 85.5 to 90.5, the frequency is 2. And from 90.5 to 95.5, the frequency is 3. This one is also three. Now, students, this is a histogram, and uh, which we have to draw according to the frequency and the marks. Now we have to draw the frequency polygon. Frequency based polygon is drawn with the midpoints. First, we have to find the midpoints. We now, students, how to find the midpoint? The formula of finding the midpoint: add the lower class boundaries and upper class boundaries then we find the midpoint and 55.5 uh, plus 60.5 uh, divided by 2 we get 58 this is the midpoint now the next one is 60.5 uh, 60.5 60 plus 65.5 126 divided by 2 we get the 63 now students 68 and uh, next one is uh, 
73 78 and 83 88 the next one is 93 and 98 and friends these are the midpoints which we have to find in this question and uh, uh, we have to draw the for for frequency polygon polygon on these midpoints part number four you have to read it first using the same diagram draw a frequency polygon to illustrate the diagram on the same diagram we have to draw the frequency polygon now so it's, this is the diagram with, where we have to draw the histogram graph paper now the midpoint is 58 this is the midpoint and uh, frequency polygon and this is a 63 next one is 68 this one and uh, the next one is uh, 73 yes this one is 73 and this one is uh, 78 83 and 88 and 93 and 98 now we have to match this point and then this, there is also a line that's why i am not drawing the students the next point is there this one now the next one is there and then the starting point we also join with these from the starting value and the last one is also we have to join with the last value and uh, now students this is the frequency polygon which we have to draw on the histogram and i hope you understand these questions very well uh, thank you very much students for watching my videos take care of yourself Allah.